Welcome back to Shave and Haircut. Welcome back. You found your way back to us again yeah. after after the long road. Yeah, it's You've, it's been so long. It and and we've come so far. Uh, I'm sorry. I should have made sure that you were okay to start recording. Yeah. Are, are we cool to start recording? We are cool to start recording. All right, do I feel good about it. All right, guess what we're playing, David? Uh, judging by the flaming of the screen, I'm gonna say either Diablo 2 because it says Diablo 2, uh -huh. or because I can't read, I'm I'm gonna say that this is a previous Doom that I'd never seen before. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I feel like Doom guys should show up in one of the Diablo games, just like at the very end, just be like, "Hey, what's up?" <laughs> Doom guy. Oh, I wonder if there's a Doom mod for Diablo. I'm gonna look for it. There, were, there would have to be. Are we? Are you going? Are you going Necromancer? I'm Is thinking the boner about coming it. back? I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. All right. Yeah. We'll Hashtag do... the boner is back. Uh, no bones. No bones. Mr. No bones. Oh, Mr. No bones. Yeah. Let's do. How Mr. about Doctor No bones? Doctor No bones. He didn't go to. He didn't go to. 18 years of bone boning school. <laughs> what? Now, let's it, close this because I don't need that. Uh, all right. All right. Well, greetings, stranger. Greetings, stranger. You know, that's something I never say to anybody, and I feel like that's something that I should start doing. Just be like, greetings, stranger. <laughs> Why don't we all just talk like NPCs for a day? All right, do we, do we want, for this playthrough, do we want to uh, leave the dialogue in? Are we worried about leaving the dialogue in? Are we worried about making sure that people that haven't played this game... Uh, if this game was any less than, what is it, like 12 years old? It's a million years old. Yeah, if this See, game if was turn, any like, less than a million years up. old, I would say absolutely, like, we should leave the dialogue in. What if somebody doesn't understand the basic story or plot of Diablo 2? you right. But, um, I don't remember how to play this game. But I think we all know the basic story and plot of Diablo 2, which is, uh, is there a thing that's alive that doesn't need to be? You kill it. You're, you're just a roaming adventurer that gets drawn up in fucking shit. Alright, cool. I'm remembering, remembering my, my keyboard Yeah, commands. your hot keys. Oh, these guys. Remember these guys? Yeah. Let's get, let's get the skill shrine. So yeah. we can summon multiple skellies. Yeah, get them skellies in there. Dr. No Bones. Oh, cool. Another... Another skill shrine. Yeah. Because you got to have one right next to the other. When was the last time we played this game together? Uh, I th Wow, another skill shrine. I, I think we were maybe 14, 15? Yeah. If I was going to be honest. Because yeah, like, after that, like like first person shooters started to really take hold. And, yeah, yeah you And that And that's right when we kind of shift our whole mantra... Oh yeah, that's right. You gotta kill the shaman. Yeah, cause he resurrects. He's a neck. He's a boner too. He's a boner. Mhm. Mm oh my god, this brings back memories. Oh god, so many memories. You're having skeletons attack zombies. It's like Evil Dead up in this bitch. <laughs> god, man, this. What's sad is like kind of a weird thing like when i first started uh playing this game i didn't play like role-playing games yeah and now that i actually play like role-playing games like playing this game it's like holy shit that's just what it is that's exactly what it is yeah Ooh, armor i'll take it it's it's damaged but it'll do it'll do the thing Nah, as I say about every single one of my relationships. Uh, wow. Listen, I'm damaged, but I'll do the thing. <laughs> uh, maybe we should switch to using, like, uh, plugins. Um, they give, like, better, uh, like, better map layout. Maybe not map hack. Yeah. Just thinking, or maybe like, map hack. Maybe map hack. I don't know, like, because the beginning of this game is really... <laughs> It's really slow. Yeah, you're it, just running around. You're just murdering things. Whacking, whacking motherfuckers. Yeah. Uh, we're in the Den of Evil. Uh, yeah. Which, um, I don't know how it got that name. I feel like there are dens way more evil than this later on. Uh, I feel like I need more strength off the bat, because I'm going to want to be able to wear like some decent armor. Some Dish armor. Some Dishon armor. Oh, yeah, I got... Uh, all right, all right. Now's now's the time to choose. Am I going? Make your choice. I know, right? Am I summoning? 
or am I going to be poison a bone, or am I going to go like because like it's it's especially for the necromancer, it's good to go for at least like mostly one and a little bit of another one, but yeah. never spread so thin that you're in all three. Yeah. Um, I I always personally liked summoning. You're yeah, you're a summony guy. I'm a summony guy. I like I like commanding an army. Yeah. Uh I I like I like poison bone spells. They're pretty cool, but they mm. kind of fizzle out. Yeah. Um curses. I kind of want to go summoning and curses. All right. Is that is that cool? That's cool. All right. We're going to do summoning and curses. Oh shit. Summon some yeah. bastards. Let them take the hits for you, man. That's what they're here for. Yeah. They're your frontline warriors. Like. I'm gonna go straight for the shaman. Oh, Fuck you, Mr. Shaman. shaman. Oh, great, a blue zombie. Why is there a blue zombie? Oh, yeah. Corpse fire. Undead spectral hit. Corpse fire. You get caught up in a corpse, corpse fire. fire. Nice. Dope. Nice little light. Oh, there's man. another shaman around here somewhere. Aha. Yeah. Yeah. There you are. There you are, you ugly motherfucker. You're holding a flag as your weapon. Uh, oh, so by the time this has come out, everybody will have watched our Spelunky episodes. Yes. I love that game. The Spelunky honestly. was fun. We might what, play what, some more of that. Yeah, what's funny is, like, you never feel like you're going to win. Yeah. At Spelunky, you never feel like, I won, but it's still great. It's true. Zambo. Kill the Zambo. Let your skellies do the, the do the heavy lifting. Oh, oh man. I should get this mana potion. Yeah. Should eat that. Wow. I love the way the little skeleton runs. Just be like, <laughs> <laughs> they're cute. Mm -hmm. Adorable. Cannot read the health on this guy. Uh, he's about to the... Oh, I'm really low, too. He's about to the E, to the F. Oh, he's healing. Hmm. Zambos don't heal. Sometimes they do. I guess. Like, when they eat brains. Yeah. I know sometimes when I eat brains, I'm just like, God. I feel so much smarter. Do, do you? Do you really? Well, depending on the brains they eat. Like, if it's dolphin brains, yes. If it's, like, possum brains, no. Ooh, I gained a level. Uh, let's put it in vitality, because I'm taking a lot of damage. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, let's make more damage, more skeleton health. Alright, yeah. Or more skeletons. Do we want to go volume? Uh... <clears throat> Let's go, let's go volume. Yeah. Well, uh, no matter what, you're going to have to take at least one in Skeleton Mastery just to uh, just to get the golems. Yeah, you're right. You're right. I, I also need more skeletons right now. Yeah. There we go. There's a third skeleton. Yeah. yeah. Take that. I'm coming here. I'm a help. Yeah. I'm a help. Fuck him well, up. See, that's Damn. the difference between leading and... <laughs> and... Uh, managing. Yeah. Yeah, see? You were a leader there, not a manager. You're right. And you were certain... Or were you a middle manager because you were in the middle of the fight? Whoa. All yeah. right. All right. Okay. I'm buying it. I'm into it. Okay, um, so I was thinking the other day. All right. What are you thinking about? Okay, so you know how, like, uh, uh, what is it? Like, one night stands kind of have, like, a, a negative connotation in our society? Yes. Okay, so I thought of a way to kind of turn that around, class them up a bit, bring a little bit of old school, you know, niceness to them. After you have a one night stand, you write a thank you letter. Okay. Yeah. Tell me that's not good. Oh, is that is that is that the end? Is that is that your idea? I thought it was good. Oh, okay. But yeah, no, just write a very nice and like considerate thank you letter. Just be like, I want to thank you last night for allowing me, you know, into your vagina. And uh, I, I want to let you know that if you need, you know, any anything in the future, that, uh, that I'll be gone and I'll be far, far away. But you know what? We, uh, I, I, again, I, I appreciate it and thank you. I don't hate that idea. Yeah. Because uh, it's just nice. Three critters remaining. 
Uh, I get a free skill point for this. Wow, cool. Um, common, commonly, uh, this quest is saved for last on all difficulties and acts. Mm -hmm. So that when you're late game, you can get that free skill and a much higher skill, or yeah, a higher tiered skill. Yeah. But fuck that, I don't care. Yeah, it's not just that. Like, you know, it's... Let's save that. It's kind of also the point of just like, you know, you're getting that free skill point, whether it's now or whether it's later, you know? You're right, you're right. Uh, so slow. So slow. That's the problem with volume versus... Oh, no, you meant your character Whoa. was so slow. He's so slow. He's tired, Zach. He's been busy, you know, doing the murder puzzle. He needs he needs a nap. He needs He needs that nap. Now you're just sort of searching around for the last Yeah, views. there's like one dude left. One monster. And I don't have a map hack on, so I can't... Ah, there he is. Alright, that that, yeah, that's it. Alright, cool. Yeah, look, now uh, the sunlight has come in. Let's assess this, because I'm aware of this ring. I saw the sun. And I'm aware of this armor. Yeah. Look at that. You're already looking snazzier. All right, return to Akara for a reward. Um, I may or may not talk to Akara. Well, no, I'm going to have to. Man, I should have hit that experience shrine earlier. Yeah. I didn't even see that there. I but know no. there's, there's one at the end of the, the cave, too. Yeah, right at the... Well, technically at the beginning of the cave. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, that's where you came in. I'm in the cave now, so it's the end of the cave. Fair point. Mm-hmm. <laughs> But yeah, no, and especially if you, like, cl seriously classed up, like, wrote it, like, you know, the way Civil War, you know, soldiers would write to their betrothed back home, just be like, oh, my dearest Angelica, I want to thank you for giving, for being the oasis in the desert of non-sex. A desert in the oasis of non-sex? Yes. Is that what you just said? That's what I said. Is that the words that just came out of your mouth? Those are the words that came out of my mouth. Okay, just making sure. Yeah. <laughs> Though I am sorry that Whiskey Dick prevented the fullest of ejaculation. Wow. I hope that you would admire my diligence and do the ditcher. What? <laughs> Civil War, that's how they talk. <laughs> Lost track of that's it there for a second. That's how, they, that's how they talked and that's how they wrote. <laughs> maybe he was finally coming. Like. <laughs> finally, after all these years. It's... I would like to enclose the semen that I did not offer you that faithful, that faithful night. That's gross. <laughs> that's gross. <clears throat> Ooh, it's a box. It's got bolts in it. Who would go through the trouble of putting bolts in a chest like that? That's my problem. Huh. Because you see what I mean. It's like, it, it's a chest in the middle of nowhere. Like, why would it just have bolts? You right. I guess it'd be like an ammo cache. Like, you know, you're going through, but... Why don't these guys ever open chests? Yeah, there's a chest, like, right here. You guys could have had this damaged buckler. Yeah. And this, this cracked quilted armor, but instead... You know, but, I should be picking this stuff up, though, because I can sell it. Classic D&D &D philosophy. Kinda. Like, D&D &D and Diablo philosophy, like, it's yeah. early game. Guess early. how much money I have. A 56 bucks. Think I can do anything with 56 bucks? Uh, you can go to Chipotle. I, right. Ooh, you want to go to Chipotle? Actually, man, there's, like, I don't know if you've tried that new, uh, taco place, uh, Habanero... Over by uh, Five Guys. I have not. Is it good? It's pretty good. Hmm. I I dug it. Like, uh, what <laughs> what made it sad though is that uh, I just like cooked tacos the night before. Oh, well, and you can have tacos two nights in a row. No, that's not what I meant. I meant like I cooked tacos and I ate them and I was like, oh man, I did really good seasoning the beef and like I did a lot of really cool stuff. Like, oh man, I'm really proud about this stuff I made. Season and, the beef is the name of my porno. Yes, it is. Uh, but, and then I went there and I tried that and I was just like, oh, all right. 
so I didn't do a good job. Like, that was my problem with it. It was 100% just be like, okay, I didn't do a good job then. Whatever. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Fine, people who professionally make tacos. Me as an amateur can't make tacos like you. Me as an amateur. Here it is. Yeah. Waypoint. Now I can always come back here. Uh, if if you've never played this game, Hi. say so in the comments. Let us know yeah. that you've never played this game. Because we're 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 gonna be fascinated by that. It's uh, very curious. It's a curious yeah. state to be in. Required strength. You can't just wield a scepter. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, but I'm not trying to do a bunch of damage. I like having the plus one to raise skeleton. I'll put it in my other slot here. Okay. With this buck, shitty buckler. Shitty buck. Shitty buck. Shitty buck. Boom, boom. Shitty buck. Boom, boom. I like a boom, boom into my heart. It's a shitty buck, buck. <laughs> shitty buck into my soul. Alright. Oh yeah, let me check and see if she has any decent wands. I don't think they I don't think she carries wands. No, I have no. to go I have to go see what's her name over here. Yeah. Cause she's sexy. She got them magic wands. Oh, well, I, I got that free skill point. Whatever. Yeah. Um what is this? Wait, what? Reset stat skill points. That's new. Nice. I say that's new. I <laughs> I haven't played this game in ten plus years. Yeah, so it could be very, very old, but... Uh, let me go ahead and get this identification tone that will more or less almost pay for itself. There. Get them teleporting. Uh, get that teleporting tone. Maybe I should save this ruby. Yeah, what if you meet, like, that special skeleton that comes along? You right. How do I immediately just drop it in there? Is there a button to do that, or do you have to put it where it goes? I always had to put it where it went. Alright, cool. Uh, look for Blood Raven in the burial grounds. We're gonna do the thing. Alright, we are Diabloing the two. Yeah, 100%. Like, or 98%. I don't know. I don't know what percentages are. <laughs> uh, I forgot to put a timer on this episode. Okay. So... I didn't even look at what time it was when we started. I think it's been... It's been a million years. Yeah, because the application that we're using to, to record isn't like... Um, it doesn't have like a... It doesn't have a timer or a clock on it or anything. Did you send a text message or anything before we started? No, I didn't. Could use... Yeah, you lose all sense of, like, time and space when you play this game, guys. True. Okay, so... I think... I think we may, be, we may have played this game for 30 minutes right now. 30 minutes? That doesn't seem right, though. No, that does not seem right. But also, can you prove me wrong? No, I guess not. Can you prove me right? I, no, I can't... I guess not. Can you prove a negative? There's negative testing. Man, these guys suck. These guys blow chunks. Sorry for keeping my map up the whole time. That's probably annoying. Is it, though? Well, I It's mean, good to know where you are. It is. It's good. It's useful for me, but, like, to a point. Yeah. People are like, we want to watch these skellies just fuck up people. And you did a good job fucking that person up, man. I did. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. You're so supportive. I I love to support. What would we? What would I do without you, David? Let's never find out. Let's never find out. Let's go through our whole lives never finding that out. Uh, let's do skeleton mastery. Oh, I can almost get that. Uh, more skeleton. Uh, this really just increases their damage by a percentage. And their attack and defense. And their, if I'm not mistaken, their attack is their chance to hit. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's their attack rating. Yeah. Which is dexterity based. Get that, uh, get that dex. Let's get dex. Sweet dex, bro. I don't want to like. I don't want to hit such a point in the game where like I wish I had more dex. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's just hot 
Dex. Ah, Dex. <laughs> so I sent her this Dex pick. <laughs> it's just like somebody just like wielding a crossbow effectively. Hilarious. Oh, speaking of wielding weapons effectively. Okay, so you know how... You have my attention. Okay, so you know uh, how, how we watch Forged in Fire sometimes. <clears throat> yes, I and, love that show. Yeah, I know, I love that show too. Well, there's a spinoff of that show. No way. Called Knife or Death. Okay. Okay, so instead of... Because with Forged in Fire, for those of you who've never seen the show, it's actually pretty interesting. Like, they get uh, four bladesmiths, or uh, and they all have to forge a blade in a certain amount of time, and... Then that blade gets tested, and then the top two have to create a weapon from history. Right, that's and, basically Forged in Fire. Yeah. Well, that's that, like the last step in Forged in Fire. Well, no, Fire. That, I'm describing Forged in Fire. Knife oh. or Death is different. Oh. Knife or Death, there is no forging. You just show up with a weapon. Oh. Like, whether you forged it or whether you bought it, apparently the rules allow both. Oh, okay, you could just go out and buy one? You could just go out and buy like, one. Like, commission a winning piece? Well, see, that's the thing. You can commission one, but it's not just about the knife you're wielding because it's about how you're wielding it. Because oh. it, they set up, like, this fucking unbelievably elaborate gauntlet of, like, using knives and weapons. This one guy had, like, a katana, and he didn't make it through. Wow. Like, he had a Japanese smith forge him a katana. And he wasn't able to make it through. Wow. Yeah, so it's as much about being able to wield your knife as it is about the knife you're wielding. Yeah, I'd watch the show. This sounds like fun. Oh, dude, and they get... they get. I think it's Stone Cold Steve Austin. He's the host. No way. Yeah. We're, like, the, we're... Here, I'm going to look it up real quick. Because right. I don't want to say that and then be wrong. And then, like, Stone Cold Steve Austin sees this show, and he's like, I don't know, I was knife or death. All right. Yeah, because Stone Cold Steve Austin definitely watches Shave and Haircut on what YouTube. You he's a big fan. You don't know that. You're right, I don't. Hosts. Uh, oh, man, the sound effects in this game. They get me. Ooh. Ooh, a socketed guitar. Neat. Okay, so it's a W. Damn, it, why don't you just say it? It's like hosted by a WWE Hall of Famer. They're not interchangeable. I mean, they are to a point, but they're not interchangeable. Right, that could be anyone. Yeah. I got so many skellies already. All right, let's look for yeah. a decent staff or a decent wand. Um, Bill Goldberg. Yeah, that's not Steve Austin. Yeah. Who the fuck? Wait, I could have sworn. Hold on, let me pull up a picture. Well, I, I can't afford any of these good ones. These are all very, very expensive. Yeah, there we go. This guy. So I guess it is just Bill Goldberg. It's, yeah, it's, it's Goldberg. All right, so Goldberg. Sorry, sorry, Stone Cold Steve Austin. I didn't. Uh, you are the last person I want to offend. You, Second yeah. only to Dwayne the Rock Johnson of wrestlers that I wish not to offend. That's a short list. Yeah. Most wrestlers I'll offend. Like that. That's fine by me. You know, like you're offended. That great. That means that you felt something, and I made you feel something. I have a lot of respect for wrestlers. Oh Res yeah. Wrestling is like there's something really phenomenal about the fandom mm -hmm. i don't get it like mm -hmm. i say i don't get it like i understand like yeah. loving a thing and i yeah. think that that's really cool and people that are really into wrestling that's mm -hmm. awesome of them yeah uh like i'm not like i didn't i didn't get on that bandwagon when i was a kid or a teenager yeah. like it was never a thing for me yeah. so like i'm not in the wrestling fandom i've always wanted to be but like, there's there's so much involved. Oh God, yeah. But I mean, I, it's so much a, lore, like characters. Yeah, the characters are developed over freaking years and years and years, so that like when they finally reach that point, you know what I'm also very impressed by? What's that? Like the full transfer between WWE wrestler to movie star. Like, it happens a lot. It does. It does. Like. 
Hulk Hogan, John Cena, The Rock, like, and not small movie stars either. Yeah, like they, like they're a big deal. Yeah. Like I don't imagine I'll be seeing The Undertaker in anything that's not made by you know Netflix or Marvel. But beyond that, yeah, because Marvel would one hundred percent do that. Oh, my skeletons do more damage if I summon them with my wand. There. And now I'll just switch to my... God, sword. yeah, look, because now they're holding, like, huge fucking shields in front of them. Yeah. Uh, I forgot that I had, like, a... Because, uh, like, I was wondering why I was doing all this uh, poison damage. And then I remembered that I still got the sword out. Yeah. With this shitty buckler. Oh, both of my bucklers are shitty. Whatever. Yeah. There is no oh, it's non Blood Raven time. Blood Raven. Poison That's blood so Raven. raven. Alright, we'll, we'll kill. Oh, dude, do you know, like, Raven Simone's on Blackish? Is she? Yeah. I still she need she to plays. Watch that show. She plays, uh, Dre's, uh, little sister. Like, she does She's not oh, on it all the I've, time. I've she she does cameo episodes. Show, yeah. So I don't, I don't know. Oh, dude, treat yourself. It's. This is gonna sound weirdly ominous, and I hate saying it this way, but it's it's the Cosby Show of our time. That's that is that is a weird way to say. Yeah, it. Yeah, I know, and all I hate things that. Considered and and all things considered, I hate that it's awful, but at the same time, it's like that was a good show, and I hate that bad people make good things. I hate it more than anyone. That's that is yeah, you're right. I that that's a good way to word that too, because it's, it's like yeah. bad people make good things sometimes, and that sucks. Yeah, and we all wish it wasn't true, but House of Cards was a decent show. Was it though? I, I liked it. I thought it had very good, like, uh, plot development. Like, I, I love, like, and I love the way that the characters interacted with each other. Like, I thought it was good. Alright, yeah, right. Uh, well, um, Blood Raven's dead, Blood so... Raven's dead, and she bleeds lightning. Yeah, of course. Of yeah. course she does. Who, yeah. Who doesn't? Uh, on the next episode of Shave and Haircut, we'll talk more about bad people that do good things. I'm gonna wait, but, like, her soul was, like, flew out of her body, and so it's like, bye, soul!